Hello everyone, um, as we can see we have new spoilers and it's about the new Timothy Walker Hot, which is coming on Star Stable soon and it's gonna be my first blind reaction uh, video on my channel and I need to say I'm super excited because I love Tennessee Walker horses. I have sadly never seen a single one in my real like in real life because they're not really on Europe. I think they're mostly on USA, that horse breed. Uh, even though I have been working on uh, like I have been working with horses in Germany and a lot of working with horses in Finland especially where I'm from. And no, I have never seen a single one and it's kinda sad why they're not like spread so much. I think of course there's like Tennessee workers like everywhere but I think they're super rare in Europe and that's why I have never seen or met a single one. And I'm not even sure there's like I'm not even sure if there's a single one in Finland. Uh, I have at least never heard of of heard of it. But yeah, let's get on the video. So I still know how their like movement works and how they're like how they're how they look like and what they are and stuff. The breed itself is not something I don't know, and that's why I do this reaction. And as well, I as I also need to tell that I have been studying horses. I own a lot of horses. We own currently twelve horses with my family. I have been training horses and stuff, so I'm super interested more of the movement than the horses, how realistic it goes. And here we see the first walking, and I know that a lot of people would say this is nice, but I like the... Yeah, it's super... This is not good, really. Uh, I'm super sorry that I need to start. I need to say that the head is super nice, it looks super tense of walking horse, the head type super well made but the walking itself it looks like it's um, having like muscle problems especially from front it's not really wide walking it's more like it's also it looks like it's needs like some massage therapy to be honest <laughs> when you look because the walking is so short and it's just the same with the back it's not it's not open walking it's more like uh, uh, for my eyes then we have trot and this is way better, this is way better, and oh my god, look at the head, the colors has been made super well, and actually a little detail, look at the ears, they're like going with the throat, that's super nice, uh, let's pay attention a little more of the throat, I wanna watch it a bit more, so here we see, um, I need to say it's super nice how the legs has been making, how the hoof takes the weight on the moment. It's been all the time more and more realistic in my opinion. But um it's super short sure. sad it's so short. But again it's kinda the why the trot is kinda it's not so realistic. There's something a bit wrong. I would say it's 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 kinda too jumpy. It looks like it would be a bit of pain as well because it's too jumpy. It's kinda the head is too jumpy, you see. But um, I need to say it's still nice. It doesn't look like it's in pain still. It's just not so realistic. But um, I would still say this is nice. This is nice because I have seen way worse. This is uh, the tail is super nice as well. That's the tail that makes the throat, in my opinion, super well because of the hair and the ears. That's maybe why it looks so like good still. But now we can, yeah, ups. Now we can check out this. And that's no, no, I'm not talking about the That's not even close to realistic tennis of working run. Gallop. This this is oh my god, why is it so short? So I need to say I don't like the gallop. This gallop at all, it looks super like I'm lazy, I'm lazy. I know that some fin horses can do this when they're super lazy. That they just race there, like the gallop. The bad side of the gallop is that if it's too like that, it's too, in my opinion, it's too like it's like a lazy gallop, like oh, pushing, pushing a step by step by step. But on the other hand, again, the ears look nice. The front, yeah, that's what I think the crater has been doing. That we look the front the gallop. 
from the legs and that looks super nice I need to add it um, I have nothing against this this is super cool uh, this looks pretty realistic when we look at the legs and that's why it's probably slow down with when you see it's look way better okay there's some box on the back leg when we cut look at slower look it like gets longer and then sure it's back but in the other hand it's super small time it's not that annoying I know that some bridge has it super annoying so that's why I would not complain about it I'm just looking for perfection and I know that takes time but when we look at this picture this looks nice you know what again the hooves is not really getting the attention I love how they have been you can clearly see that they have been doing a lot of work mostly on the head and that's super nice like I have nothing against this and then this this is not maybe tennis or walker running but it's super nice running I really like this actually it's super open for once it's super open wow actually wow look at the front legs uh, on the second one it's super open and wide like gallop and this is what I like I'm looking for and the head perfectly like um, goes with it and that's what I really like damn no seriously that's super nice work that's like the best animation they have been doing so far that's super wide that's super and when we see I wish I could sew with my finger fingers but this area when you look um, I don't really know what's called in English uh, and I'm just gonna say chest so the chest is super it's super open it's super it's it like fits with the movement so fast uh, like not fast but well and that's what I really like it's not over animated but not like sometimes they had a problem that it, it's losing the animation and that was super perfect um, I can't stop watching this diam and the legs especially the legs they're like looking from the ground kinda what they don't do in the other ones this is diam it's like yeah yeah that's that's super cool again the tail and the center colors now we have the reverse and every horse has kind of different reverse uh, no matter what breed it is so I don't really take part of this of course with the movement as well but like mostly the reverse is something which I feel like you don't really breed with horses out train so much well you train but you know it's just reversing when you ask they're not so much of the how it's reversing I feel like it so I don't have a lot of uh, opinion it I just I would say that it again looks that it's in pain but then again a lot of horses reverse with the mini steps and uh, I need to say the head is super nice um, normally I would complain about the neck that this looks super small compared to head but now we need to remember that tennis walker horses actually has kind of that type of uh, neck and we can actually check on the Google pictures here's one picture you see the neck is pretty small but one thing that I really miss that stars they build any pay attention is the back legs on since walk and this is why I really love this breed because the standing is like it's the breed has the not skill but ability that's just bred that way that they stand kind of like this like a large and I hope that Star Stable actually would have done something with standing but we will see okay especially Kate this is gonna be a negative revive for me um, it's it should have been faster it should have been raising a little bit more of the legs in my opinion this is again like the head is kind of moving with too much that's what I was talking about the over animation and the back legs doesn't like barely have any lifter like legs it's just uh, 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 uh. it's more like um, a horse who you know when you are working with a horse on the not at home like what's called again you go with to work in a forest or somewhere like away from home area and when you turn around that you're gonna walk to home so they start to speed up that's that's how it looks they're like oh my god like it feels when you ride that they do this but they're like hop 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 like trying to walk fast to home 
because horses usually like to um, like to hunt way faster. So this is this is more like it than Cincy Walker walking, and this is kind of sad. Now we see again jumps. Um, now I need to say I don't really know about the Tensor Walker jumps. I have never seen a Tensor Walker jump in even in videos or anything. As I said, I had never seen a Tensor Walker in real life. But um, let's just make a general. Um, it looks bad, but then again, it doesn't look so bad as it could. And it I feel like Star Stable has a lot of to work on the jumping animations in general. Uh, I know that they're trying to. They're like I see that what they have been like focusing the animators has been focusing when they have been doing it, but it's still missing a lot of out. And I don't wanna like start to give a negative reward because it's pretty good. It's way better than in many other horse games. And we see how they're trying. To be honest, the back legs should be paying attention more. They are paying a lot of attention how they jump and how their front body goes, but they don't really pay attention on the back body because it's as follows kind of. It's like a, it's like two different horses jumping front and back. It's like shared different horses, and that's kind of that's not how it looks. But again, it's not so bad because it doesn't look so unrealistic as it could, in my opinion. Yeah. Also, the when you look at the back leg, look at the back legs when they sit on the ground. Um, here, that's kind of bucked on the left back leg. But um, it's so small detail again that you need to be super perfect genius <laughs> to pick that up, and that's why I don't want to complain a lot of about the jump. Now we're gonna get stuff. Um, yeah, that looks super good. Yeah, that's actually super nice. It's again not overreacted, like over animated or that it's lacking out animation. It's simple, it's 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 just simple and well made. Yeah, I have nothing to complain about it. I really like this one. I really like as well that the tail is coming with it. Um yeah. Again that's yeah, I have nothing to complain. This is actually I need to say that this is super well made actually. This is maybe one of the most realistic, um, like, is it called a rare in this? I guess. But this is one of the most realistic. Look at how the back legs are taking the part when it's jumping a little front. This is, I need to say, this is maybe the most realistic that kind of jump they have in this game. And that's super amazing that they're actually working on it. Dance, yeah, the most important. <laughs> That's just the common animation that just put on the pre It Okay, now we see the idle. I wanna really see it to use the legs back. It's kinda using, but that's. I could not guess easily that this is a tenant of working horse from the breed. Standing, I mean. It's lacking a lot of potential for the breed. Okay. It. It's not doing it. This is more like Napster Pro. And you could stand like this. Or anything else. Or harness racing horse. If I would see a brown horse, uh, if this horse was brown, I would think that this is a harness racing horse. Like, you know, the harness racing breeds. But, um,. Yeah, I, I, need to, I need to say this is a lot of attention. I wanna buy these horses because the animation are nice, the model itself is nice. But the only thing I want to give like extra like means in this case is the standing because it has nothing to do with it breed. It's a standing normally, like any other horse. And I know that the Nancy Walker horses stand like this as well. But now when we talk about the breed, I kind of would like that their breed would show super strong in the game. Now, when we attack in the game, so it would be standing super strong, not standing like it would be super. They would have super, maybe a bit over animated of the breed, so it would be way better. But um, no, it's lacking everything. I don't understand why they could not make a little, even a little animation where it's like scratches like this or stands a bit like this. Also, they're missing the tail. That's what that makes me sad. That the breed has usually this tail, 
uh, ability to have. As we can see, not everyone, but a lot of the have. I think it's when they're excited that they have the always scratching tail like Arabians has. But um, it's not shown in any of these. It's not. It's not coming out how people are recognizing the Tinder Walking Course. That's what I'm trying to look for because now it's looking like anything similar breed. But now we could check colors. This is maybe my favorite. Even though I haven't seen them too often, this might be my favorite because I really love this color. And this is how I recognize them as the working horses. Like I, I, I like, like brown of them. Brown as the working horses. Um, this is also super fine. I would buy this as well. I don't want to pay attention so much the colors because I know they know what they do it for a while. This again is super nice. This reminds me of the Red Dead Online. It was a tense walking horse. I, I forgot what horse it was. Creole, I think it was. Red Dead, but again, looks super nice. Um, this is also super nice, but maybe not so much my style. Still super well made though. This is normal black, yeah, super nice. And also super nice, to be honest, yeah. They have been learned super well to shade the dark spots with the normal color uh, with all the models they are kind of lacking on it and um, yeah there's 10 years old difference of course they have been getting better this is yeah. I really love the head I really love the model itself but what is mis missing is the breed animations not even the tail lifting not even the standing even for a little second animation you know when they have this little side animations when they're standing nothing so that's kind of what makes me sad we could check but if you can see the hat tail is super scratchy uh, you can see kind of from the movement as well and we can see how it's raising the legs that's an ability for the breed it's not always animal abuse And yeah, actually, what was also missing was the back legs. It's not moving in star stable so much as it's in this. And as we can see, the head is not moving so much. It's moving, but it's not moving so much. Yeah, this is what I was what I wanted to, them to have, but they were kind of missing it out. Yeah, here we see with the when it's on the outside of the stable, so it's more excited. And this is what I wanted are able to kind of pay attention for since they make different breeds and I think you can see the tail I was talking about our scratchy tail with them so yeah I think that was enough um, I really hope that uh, you guys like this this became super long but I wanted to make super um, I wanted to make this video from the view of person who actually works with horses not i see a lot of like reaction from people who just play the game but i wanted to do like an ultra point of view and i hope that people liked this uh, i didn't mean to be so negative and i don't want to be super negative i really know that so stable is not doing it on purpose that just need to pay attention more of little details and i understand if you're not haven't been like li living around the horses for uh, forever it's way harder to spot them and that's why I won't judge because game animator is way different than horse actually horse people so that's why we need to understand the little line why they can do it so perfectly job but now we see and I really hope you like this video and uh, we will see in this video if you're interested of my content and you're always welcome to subscribe so bye bye